What's around, everybody? Welcome to your daily tarot quickie. You have the Eight of Pentacles. So this was around nothing. You are focusing. That's what it is. You shouldn't be looking around. Look down. Look at your project. Okay. So um, it could be a new project that you're working on that you're focusing on. It could be something that you're already doing, but you want to take it to the next level. You know, um, this is um, higher knowledge and education. And go figure. It is um, today is a Jupiter day. So hey, let's get it in, right? So um, you want to master something. You want to be known for something. You know, um, some people are into titles. I'm not into titles, but you want to put that, those dots and those letters, you know, behind your name. Or um, it could be owner, you know, it could be creator, it could be producer. Uh, whatever it is, um, you want to master that. Um, even if it's, you know, cooking, um, something that you want to get really good at and you always fail at but today is the day you're going to get that mac and cheese recipe right today yes you are today is the day so um and if you're on the um pathway of the storms so, hey that's a, that's a nice winter um feel good you know, forget, I know I write for high cholesterol. I know, but I'm just saying sometimes you got to treat yourself, especially if you're working hard like you're doing right now, right? The carbs, you're burning out all this, these calories by thinking and moving and getting and thinking and moving and getting and doing, you know? Maybe I should come up with a song like that. But anyway, um, Eight of Pentacles. So you want to take it to the next level. And if you're not feeling like that, that means you need to, it's been bothering you and you need to be out there and you need to be getting into your project and your things you want to do even if it's if you want to go to the next position you know in your career whatever it is you know um as small or as big as it is and you're looking at the details of it the fine details of it um where um you're perfecting it but let me tell you something about perfection sometimes it can drive you crazy shout out to the virgos out there how y'all doing Anyway, this is like Virgo energy, you know, especially if you're Virgo and you're one to 10 degrees in to Virgo, this this is calling for you, you know, um, step away for a minute, just hold up for a minute. I know, I know, I know, but you know, maybe you need to take a break, take two hours, three hours, a whole day, a weekend, something, and just step back because when you step back, you can have a broader perspective on what's going on and what you need to do next. Sometimes when you're so, so too focused and too focused so long, you kind of miss other things, you know, around you. Because remember I said, you're not looking around, you kind of focus and that's good. But there's a balance to everything. Shout out to the Libras. There's a balance to everything. So if you feel like you're frustrated, you feel like, okay, I'm working on these things step by step. I'm doing my affirmations. I'm doing this. I'm writing my journal. I'm da da da. It doesn't work in. I put this effort in. I made this many calls. I put this many emails in. I did this many posts. Whatever it is, and nothing's not working out. But step away. Step away for a moment. It's going to hurt to step away. I get it. It's going to hurt, especially today. It's going to hurt to step away. But take some time. Step away. Clear yourself, okay? Clear your mind. Clear your body. You know, clear your soul. Clear your heart. Clear everything. You know, just focus on something fun for a moment, you know? Even if it's just taking a nap. A nap is good sometimes. You probably haven't slept because you've been so concentrated. And you know, when you're on a project... And shout out to the people, creative people out there who's been doing this over and over and over. Every time you start a new project, you're not sleeping. You know, you're not seeing your parents. You're not seeing your wife. You're not seeing your kid. Like, you're not really you're shutting down everything. Like, your best friend, the shows that you used to watch no more, you would watch. The places you used to go, you're not going no more. The things you used to think about, you're not even sweating no more because you're so focused on it. And that's good. Remember, that's a good thing because that's how you get things done. No, I can't go out tonight. But no, I can't do this. What you doing? I, I'm busy right now. I got some things I want to work on right now. What is that? You don't have to go into detail because not every, oh, it's 2022. Let me put this out there. Not everybody is going to get it. Okay. So you don't have to put all your details of what everything you're doing and break it down because people are not going to get it. Okay. That's why you have to withdraw yourself. You have to get away from the hustle and the bustle and kind of settle down and say, all right, this is what I got to do. Have a good day. Day and night.